Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Yes, it is 2022. Welcome back. If you are a newbie, hey girl, welcome. Hey guys, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back. Um, to all my newbies, if you like these type of videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the like and comment down below some just sweet gestures for 2022. But today what I'm going to do, I am going to take you along with me as we go and pick up my new M1 Pro MacBook Pro 16 inch. Stay tuned. Sit down, sister. It's not worth your time. Hi guys, we are now at the Apple store. I am about to pick up my MacBook Pro 16 inch. I just thought I would take you along with me. As you can see, there's the Apple store back there in the background. I do have this on cinematic mode. This is shot on my iPhone 13 Pro Max. So I got it set on cinematic mode, but you can see that little nice Apple sign there. And I had an appointment, so I'm gonna go in and just let them know I'm here to pick up my MacBook. All right, you guys, we got the goods. Now let's go home and unbox. Okay, you all, let's start with this unboxing. My well, goodness, y'all, it is cold. It's like ice cold. It has that little circle around the apple sign, as you can see, in this plastic paper. I would assume this is some recyclable paper. So let's see what we have in the box. We have some paperwork designed by Apple or California. Of course, we know what this is going to be. This is going to be probably some stickers and just other paperwork. Yep, so we have some black apple stickers this time. And just your usual paperwork you get with all of the Apple products, pretty much. That's it of that. Okay. Right here we have our braided cable. But we're going to go ahead and take this out now because we will be using that shortly. And 
And I guess I'm not opening this right. But hey. I mean, apple goodness. Very secure presentation here. So you see we have the braided cord in our MagSafe charger. And our adapter. And let's see, we'll set this to the side here. And now for the main event, y'all. Let's get this thing opened and set up. And it comes engraved with this MacBook Pro on the side here. of beauty. Look at that. And I did get this in silver. At first I was kind of bummed out because I kept checking the website for silver. Um, this is the 16 gigabyte with 512 um, storage and this is the base model and the storage just cannot keep this one in stock. So I had to like look every day to make sure that it was in stock. So I'm really happy that it did come in stock and I could get it because I did not need any more memory or anything bigger than that. Look at that. It is immaculate. The screen is absolutely beautiful. I love the keyboard. It is all black. There is no touch bar on this model, which I'm kind of really bummed about because I did enjoy the touch bar on the last model, but y'all look at this screen. It's huge. And that's one of the primary reasons why I wanted to go with this model. Now I think I'm going to set this up as a new computer. I don't think I'm going to take anything and transfer it from my old one. Okay, you guys, we got the MacBook Pro 16 inch all set up. 
as you can see it is a 16 inch y'all look at this screen it is absolutely beautiful there are no words on how pretty this screen is um, the camera doesn't do it justice look at I mean just look at it um, and then you got your keyboard here which is all black and it is a backlit keyboard um, if you're in a darker situation look at your trackpad here it's pretty big and the thing that I like about this particular laptop is they did bring the ports back. So you have your SD card slot here. You have a Thunderbolt. You have an adapter um, over here. You have, let's see, you have your charger, your connector, where you connect your charger, headphone jack, and two more Thunderbolt ports. So it's just, y'all, it's just beautiful. Um, let's do this. At the bottom of it, um, it does come engraved. I think I got it backwards, y'all. But it does say MacBook Pro. And this is in silver. It's just, y'all, it's gorgeous. So on this Mac, well, you can see we got the infamous um, notch. <laughs> of course, that notch is not really worrisome. Um, a lot of times if I'm on the MacBook working with it, um, a lot of times that notch, notch is actually blacked out. So it's really, really not noticeable when you're actually working on the computer. So let's see here. Keyboard has a nice touch. It is, I think these are the butterfly keyboard. I could be wrong. I think it is. Like I said, y'all, I'm not a tech channel. <laughs> I'm just an everyday user and do my school work and edit my videos. And you have your touch ID right here. Of course, you see there is no, um, touch bar which I kind of miss the touch bar because it was an easier way for me to put emojis in my email or text so now I have to figure out what commands I use to get my emojis it's something that I will miss not something that I have to have but it's something that I do miss that I really enjoyed on the last MacBook okay so if you all like these type of videos, hey, go ahead and subscribe. Go ahead and hit that bell for notifications and comment down below if you upgraded to a MacBook Pro or a Mac MacBook Pro Max. Um, this is just the Pro version. I didn't need the Max version. All right. Y'all have a great day. All women with dreams. Tonight the world is ours.